Hey YouTube. So as y'all saw, I'm making me some breakfast, some eggs, bacon. I got some avocado that I might throw this one away because it's kind of old, but I got another avocado. So I'm making an egg, toast, bacon, avocado sandwich. Um, so y'all, this is my last day off from work. I had my four day um, Labor Day weekend. I was off Saturday, Sunday. Well, I was kind of off Sunday because I only work in the morning Sunday. But basically, yeah. But um, Monday, Tuesday, this is my last day. I go back to Mark to work tomorrow night but I just cleaned up my house I still need to vacuum and mop and everything so yeah I just got hungry so yeah um so I've been seeing some stuff online um about Kevin Hart um so yeah like people been saying, Miss True Red Bowman saying everybody basically on my Facebook been posting prayers for Kevin Hart. And we do pray that Kevin Hart has a speedy recovery because we need them laughs, Kevin. We need them laughs. Like, <laughs> don't nothing be wrong with you. I pray that, you know, you got, I pray that God, you know, puts them healing hands on them doctors, them nurses, whoever is, you know, caring for you, you know, anoint you, you know, so you can heal in a timely manner, you know, we need them laughs, Kevin Hart, um, you know, and I know this is just gonna be a notch on your, you know, your comedy, because you always be coming up with some funny shit, and I know that this is probably going to be something in your comedy that you probably work your know, in your head. You know, oh, I was in the car accident and you're going to make something funny out of something negative. And I love that about you because even though it was a sad and tragic situation, I know and people know, your fans know, that you're going to make this something that you're gonna make this into something funny even though it's very serious but you you don't take nothing serious you know you make everything laughable so yeah but we pray that you have a speedy recovery and everything um so um I haven't heard nothing about, there wasn't, haven't been nothing about Florida, really, um, um, it's my, it's Tuesday, I want to know if Florida didn't got hit or anything, we know the Bahamas got hit bad, um, but it's Tuesday, they said Florida was supposed to be hit really bad Monday, so, um, and they haven't been talking about that, the news don't come off, well, the news just went off, so, I ain't really mention nothing about it really too much um so yeah I got my lemonade in my cup um I just want to say I had a few subscribers like maybe one or two subscribers um and I want to say hello to all my new subscribers I'm Queen P um, I do everything on my channel. I'm still trying to figure out where I want my channel to go. I don't want no negative content on my channel. Um, I'm really about positivity and all of that. So, there's not going to be no drama, negative stuff on my channel. Um, so yeah, but mostly like family hauls, um, probably makeup videos or you know hair videos or something whatever you know but it's just strictly no negativity on my channel um so yeah what else um that's basically it my kids are still at school um I'm about to eat I'm hungry 
but yeah like I said hello to my new subscribers I did put on my other social media sites that I do have a YouTube channel y'all it is so hard for me to go out there of course I comment on other videos about who wants to support small youtubers or if you're a big youtuber who wants to support youtubers I do do that a lot but as far as putting it out there like on my snapchat or my Instagram or my Twitter or something that's really nerve-wracking to me because I'm still a little bit uncomfortable with sharing that I have a YouTube channel some people know I have a YouTube channel like my boyfriend knows now everybody on my snapchat my Facebook my Instagram my Twitter knows that I have a, a YouTube um so I'm still kind of nervous about people knowing that I have one but it's all good it's okay it's okay um you feel me we gon' just continue to build this channel and uh, I had a lot of positive feedback from people about you know not being nervous about certain things and just go for what you want and this is what I'm doing um I'm really trying to be consistent with it because you know in the past I really wasn't consistent with it um it wasn't going where I wanted to go but as I see like a little bit of progress here and now you know I do get discouraged a little bit because I feel like man why is it my subscriber count going up I'm making these videos I'm trying to make good content I'm editing you know my videos and everything why isn't you know stuff not happening but it does take time like I said a lot of youtubers work really hard over the years to get where they at and some youtubers are lucky enough to just know people and then their subscriber count subscriber count just jumps to the roof you know so with me I gotta work hard to get what I want <laughs> it's not just gonna be handed to me or I don't know anybody who's just gonna put me on you know what I'm saying you gotta work hard for what you want and I like people like that you know working hard people um but yeah so but I'm still trying to figure this channel out and still trying to figure out what I want to do. I'm still going to just make my videos and be me like I've always been. Nothing else. Nothing fake. Not following. Um, so yeah. Um, I plan on... What else I say? I don't know. Um, but yeah, y'all. So I got my bread and my food. I'm about to eat. I'm so hungry. Oh, and I did um I did see Miss Cherokee's video about people stealing like people stealing from the government money, like the disabled money and stuff. That's it's very sad and it's very um I know it's probably hard on her because like she said, it's the first of the month, you know, bills are due, you know, that shit is really crazy and God is watching whoever did that and you know, he don't sleep. So like she said, enjoy her money because God gonna get y'all, okay, you feel me? And just be ready for his comeback when he comes, okay? Because he's coming hard. You don't steal from people. You know, you don't take from people. That's not right. You know what I'm saying? It's wrong. It's very wrong. You know, that's somebody's money that they need for their bills, for their family. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? And for somebody to just take her shit like that is very wrong and very very rude on all levels so hopefully she works all that out so she can get her money back because you know that's just crazy um i know people who's been on social security for long many many years and i never heard nobody taking their money or anything like that um so yeah that is very crazy and if it was a part on the disability people part then she probably needs to call them and figure out what's going on on day end you know what I'm saying so and then I don't want to even put it on maybe it could be the hurricane too because I know like sometimes maybe that maybe could mess things up you know because I mean they're trying to just 
you know, people are, you know, in the hurricane trying to get their money from Social Security and all of this other stuff. So they probably, you know, just at the at the Social Security office or something's going on. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully she gets all that worked out. You know, so yeah, but anyway, y'all, y'all like, comment, and subscribe, 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 and I'll see y'all in my next video, but I'm about to get my grub on, you feel me, and yeah, so bye.